Hi everyone, I hope all is well. This week's Parsha is a double Parsha, Parsha Vayaka Pekude. And right off the bat in Parsha Pekude, Rabbi Moshe Feinstein asks a very good question. He says, Pekude, it means to count. What are, what are we counting here? In Parsha Vayaka, we see that all the donations and contributions made toward the Mishkan not only was enough, which is a calculated uh, amount, but it was extra, there was leftover. So Rabbi Moshe Feinstein is asking, what, what are we counting? Why are we recounting everything donated and contributed toward, toward the Mishkan? So he gives a very beautiful answer that is relevant to all of our lives, especially approaching the time of Passover, about making detailed calculations. And he said, look, everything donated toward the Mishkan is a finite resource that is just a means to an end, a mode for producing opportunity. And, but yet, we're so meticulous in making these little calculations about monetary matters. He said, so too, we could learn a very important lesson because the time in our lives is the same, goes the same way. Right? It's a finite resource, it's a means to an end, and a mode to produce opportunity. It's, it goes under the same category. So just to keep it short and sweet again, there's the beautiful message we could learn out of here is that we should, according to Rabbi Moshe Feinstein and great sages also, for thousands of years that we should make a detailed calculation of our of the time we spend during our day at at every night we should say what did what didn't go so well today what went well today what can i improve on and that way we could really maximize our time on uh, on this world making these little detailed calculations so i give everyone a bracha that uh by making these detailed calculations as seen with pakude in this week's parsha even if we even even if we know what we have just to go over it again and to really digest what we've done, what could we do better, what to improve on. And yeah, with that, I wish everyone a Shabbat Shalom.